if you were a government and if you were planning on confiscating the Bitcoin of publicly traded companies, and again, let's confiscating is an inflammatory word. Let's say nationalizing. If you were a government planning on nationalizing companies with Bitcoin on the balance sheet, would you want a micro strategy with a million coins on the balance sheet? And then there's another 50 companies, all with 50,000 Bitcoin on the balance sheet. If you wanted to confiscate a large majority or nationalize so that you get exposure to Bitcoin through nationalizing a lot of these publicly traded Bitcoin treasury companies, wouldn't it be a little bit more difficult to nationalize 50 different companies with 50,000 Bitcoin on the balance sheet? Of course it would be. It would be so much easier for you to sell the idea of getting exposure to Bitcoin by just making one small little handshake agreement with Michael Saylor. And if he holds 80 to 90% of the Bitcoin held by all of the publicly traded companies in the US, that would make your life so much easier, wouldn't it?